Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the Bernina Embroidery Software Fatal Error Exception Access Violation message you're coming across on your computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So all you have to do is open up the Start menu, type in File Explorer. Best match should come back with File Explorer. Go ahead and open that up. Select this PC on the left panel, and then double click on your drive where the application is installed. Most of you guys should be the drive that Windows is installed on here, so the local disk. So we're gonna go double click on it. Double click on the program files folder, and locate Bernina. If you do not see it in this folder, there might be a program files times 86 folder you'd wanna double click on instead. And now that we're in here, double click on the Bernina folder, double click on the embroidery software eight, and then there should be a recover folder, double click on it. And if there's anything in here, go ahead and highlight over it, right click and delete, or use your delete shortcut on your keyboard just to delete it. And once you're done with that, you can click on the back arrow. And now you wanna go ahead and locate the bin folder, so go double click on that. There should be a file in here that says defaults.dfl. Go ahead and right click on it and you copy it. So right click and copy, and then you would go back to the embroidery software up here at the top, just click on it. And then you would navigate over to the RES folder, double click on it, right click inside the folder in a blank area and you paste it in. It will likely say that there's already a file that exists in this folder and then just select replace the file in the destination. Once you're done with that, close out of here. You would then restart your computer and that'd be about it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.